There are really many ways to cook a zucchini, but a major cut them in half, stuffing them and then crisp baking them in the oven. I can hear you from here going, mmm, Ligurian stuffed zucchini. Let's start. I boiled the zucchini for about 5 or 6 minutes in the pot with boiling salty water. Then I drained them in a bowl with ice water to stop the cooking and to keep their color vivid. Now I'll start trimming them. Then I cut them in half. And with a scoop I'll remove the pulp. Be careful not to take too much because we need the skin to keep it in shape. I suggest you take care that the skinny are fresh, because not only are the old ones a bit floppy, but they might be a bit bitter. I keep the pulp aside because I will need it after. I'm finished with the zucchini, now I'll take care of the stuffing. I'll put the bread in this bowl, and since it is stale, I'll soften it with milk. I mix it and then I move to the stove. One drizzle of oil in a pan, I'll turn it to the maximum temperature, and I also add the chopped onion, then the drained anchovies. Now I can lower the temperature, and let it cook until the anchovies are well dissolved. The onion is well stewed, and I can add to the zucchini pulp. And sauté for a couple of minutes. The sofrito is ready. I'll let it cool down for a moment. In the meantime, I take care of the rest. I'll blend the tuna fillets that I've already drained. Then I'll add the capers that I've already rinsed, the toasted pine nuts, and finally the soaked bread that I'll squeeze first. Let's close the mixer and start. That's how our mixture looks. Beautifully compact. Now I'll transfer it in a bowl and I'll add to the zucchini pop too. And I'll keep adding grated parmesan cheese, eggs, and I'll season it salt, pepper. I'll flavor it with a few springs of thyme. And finally, I add breadcrumbs. And now let's begin stuffing the zucchini. Here it is, the first one is ready. I'll go ahead by this with all the others. All the zucchini are ready, you just have to transfer them on a baking pan. I've already greased it, but if you prefer, you can use a sheet of parchment paper. And complete with a sprinkle of breadcrumbs. This will help us create a nice golden crust. I'll bake them in a preheated oven on grill mode at 250 degrees for about 10 12 minutes, or anyway until they are crispy on the surface. Once cooked, let them rest for 5 minutes. The Ligurian stuffed zucchini are a second course perfect for any occasion, especially on Sundays. I'll link down below the photo recipe on Gelo Zafirano where you can find doses, ingredients and the step by step procedure. If you liked this video, please leave us a nice like and if you have any questions, write them in the comments. If you haven't done it yet, subscribe immediately to the channel to stay up to date with all the news. Did this recipe make you hungry? Cook it yourself and let me know.